Hi everyone, it's Eddie here at Eddie Makes Art. And I wanted to share some of the new things I've put up on my Etsy shop. And they're all digitals, which is great. And um, I've put a few things up. Uh, you may have seen them. This is my La Familia cabinet cards. And the reason it's titled that is because it is pictures of my family that I have um, digitized and uploaded for you to use. And this particular kit comes with several pages. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five, and six. And it comes with at least two sizes of each print. Um, and then you can use those to make your cabinet cards, especially like these larger ones. They're great for cabinet cards. Um, I'll link the video to the um, cabinet card making I did with um, these images. So, that cute little girl. She's a pretty lady. She's ready for a night on the town. So you see, you know, we've got little one here and then we've got the larger one here. So you can, you know, use them for cabinet cards or you can use them for other ephemera for your tags, all sorts of fun. I love this one, this is my favorite, right there. Okay, so that's one set. And the next set, it's not really a set, well, it's a set of six, but it's six tags. Um, these are photographs that I took when I was down in Arizona last year um, and I visited the Bisbee Copper Mine. And I went to the quarry, the Bisbee Copper Quarry, which is not in use anymore. Um, but I got these wonderful, wonderful pictures um, of the different views inside the quarry. And the colors of the quarry itself are amazing because there's all sorts of um, minerals and, and metals in here. Um, it's not an active quarry anymore. Um, but it, it has some wonderful, wonderful colors and layers. So I, I digitize them, uh, put them up on Etsy as tags. So you can download the sheet. You get one sheet of six tags, but you can print them up as much as you want. And same for any of these digitals. Um, once you purchase them, you can print them out as much as you want. And the next one is Boricuas. It's the 1960s fashion Boricua style. And if you don't know, Boricua is something that Puerto Ricans, we call ourselves. Um, and these are, again, my family photos, mostly of my mom, who was a bit of a fashion icon in her youth. And that's her. That's her here in the park in 1965. You can see the date there. And this is my Uncle Angel. Here is my mom with her fur trimmed collar her fur trimmed coat and here with a stuffed animal she loved her stuffed animals so you get these uh i believe it's two pages of fun images from my family from the 1960s maybe a little bit earlier but generally these are all from the 1960s and um see this one is great because it has the old tape still attached so it gives you that nice grungy vintage look um, you know, in these, they have the edges and they haven't been edited or anything. They've just been sized so that they, um, they look good when you download and print them. And so you go to get three, six, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 images that again, you can print out as many times as you want. And I'm going to do this one next. Now this is my favorite. Um, this is a, this is my dad and he is. Um, in the photo, he's, he's got frosting. He's, he's filling up his, he had filled up his, um, piping bag and he's getting ready to frost some cakes. So he was a baker for many years when I was a kid and we, um, yeah, we definitely got to taste a lot of his stuff that he brought home. And he had this little blue box of recipe cards from the restaurant and he would keep them at home but he would have them like i said it's this little blue plastic box and then um 
I was always, you know, fascinated by them. So I always, you know, take them out, look at them and try to figure them out. Um, but these are, I digitized them and these are all of his original recipe cards. They are restaurant quantities. That makes sense. So for example, like you see here for the gingerbread, it's two pounds of sugar. This is gonna make a lot, a lot, a lot of gingerbread. So, you know, just if, if you attempt these recipes, be aware that these are for much larger um, uh, batches. But you can see how, like, this is the original grunge. There's no editing, no enhancing. This is the original, you know, stains of sugar and, and, and butter and shortening and all sorts of fun stuff, chocolate. And in this set, you get, I think there's five on a page. So you get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight pages, nine pages. You had nine pages here um, that you can print out as many times as you want, but they make great ephemera. They make, um, they're great for if you're doing a cookbook themed uh, junk journal or, um, you know, a baking journal. These are, are great. You cut them out. You can, um, if you want, you can print them on a heavier card stock and um, make them into pockets. Or you can also uh, make them into tags, but they're, they're really fun. I love it. They're so, so cool. As you can see, like, look at that. Handwriting and everything. This is all his handwriting. Okay. So I'm gonna set these aside. And then these are my newest babies. These are my original gel prints that I've uploaded um, as digikits onto my Etsy shop. And they come in four groups. There's about seven to 10 images in each group. And these are original gel prints that I've um, created as backgrounds. And so my, my intent was for you to be able to download these and use them in all sorts of different things like uh, backgrounds, you know, um, journal pages. You can make, you know, cut them up, use them for uh, collaging. There's all sorts of stuff you can use these for. Now, the what I'm showing you here are, this is what they call a, um, and I forgot the term. Well, basically, it's much smaller versions uh, of the images. Just so I wanted to fit them on several pages. I didn't want to print out a whole stack um, last night. But what I did was I put, you know, four on each page. So these are, you know, quarter sizes. But what you download will be uh, eight and a half by 11 in size. And so for this kit in particular, you will get four, these four here. Right, and you get these four, and you get these two. So this is this particular run, you get 10 images, um, and you can download them as many times as you want and have fun with them, create something beautiful. These, uh, this is another group. I have four groups, but I only printed up three. Um, but you get the idea, and these are fun too all kinds of textures and colors and, and um, you know, styles. Uh, and you can, like I said, use them for um, scrapbooking, collage. You can even print them out and frame them up and put them on your wall. I'd be happy with that. And um, next, is this kit and this is um really fun kit i like this one it's only seven images in this one but it's very fun it's summer it's spring it's it's just very vibrant and um with the cool you know cool colors uh and these are all original by me um so i hope you go over to my etsy shop and i'll link it all below in the description box. I hope you check it out and take a look and um, at least take a look and favorite what you like and let me know what you think. Thank you so much. Have a great day, everyone.